Under the Blood Red Sun by Graham Salisbury. In school, we gloss over America's mishaps, the Pearl Harbor attack being one of them. I wanted to learn more about what it would have been like to live through that harrowing experience. Graham Salisbury does an excellent telling of the life of young Tommy Nakagi and his struggles being a Japanese American boy. Tommy Nakagi has a strong-willed grandfather, parents who understand their place in society, and Tommy who does not seem to understand everything that's happening in the world. His holy white friend Billy knew that hanging around Tommy wasn't the best idea based on societal standards at the time. Tommy and Billy are the best of friends despite the happenings in the world, though that all seemed to change after one night. Army men's up the cemetery, bodies from Parohaba. Bodies? It hadn't even occurred to me that people had been killed down there. Lots of bodies, Tomikazu. Lot of bodies. Did you go up there and look? Lot of dead peoples. Grandpa and I sat in the dark without speaking, listening to the jackhammers. After a while, we went back inside. Grandpa laying down on his mat. He crossed his arms over his chest and stared at the ceiling. I woke several times again. Jackhammers. Noises in the yard. Grandpa's rooster off schedule. The black dead of night made every little fear bigger. I almost couldn't stand it. Every movement in the trees outside was a Japanese soldier sneaking up to the house. Every da 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 of the jackhammers at the cemetery brought back the faces of dead people staring out from the magazines at Billy's house. Every distant barking dog was a warning that when the sun finally rose, we would be looking down the barrels of enemy guns. Da 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 da. I covered my ears. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. There are many exciting things that I really liked about this novel. The first one is Salisbury's version, first version of this novel was rejected because it was told from Billy's point of view and it didn't actually have a heart until it was told from Tommy Nakagi's point of view. Secondly, I appreciate the amount of research, the culture, and the heritage that went into this novel. Lastly, even myself being a hole, I was let in on all the jokes and truly felt the pain and suffering that Tommy went through. This book educated me on sections of the Pearl Harbor attack that we glossed over in school and I'm very thankful that I read this series. And I think everyone should give this a look, especially if you grew up in America talking about Pearl Harbor and not fully understanding everything that went on. Fun, exhilarating, and heart-wrenching. Please give Graham Salisbury's Under the Blood Red Sun a read. Thank you.